So last Thursday morning, uh, we had a, a fight uh, occur inside the cafeteria at Eastside Memorial High School uh, involving several students. Uh, we're still determining uh, what caused the fight and why it occurred. Uh, several students were involved. Uh, I'm sure many people have seen the social media video that was uh, put out by the students uh, showing several students involved, uh, throwing chairs, uh, hitting one another, uh, quite a bit of chaos for a short period of time. And so what we're doing now is we're reviewing the footage, uh, we're contacting the students involved, we're trying to determine what happened uh, and determine what we need to do uh, to prevent these types of situations from occurring in the future. Uh, the day of the incident, two juveniles were detained for assault uh, and they were transported to Gardner Beth Street Hall facility. Uh, that doesn't end the investigation. We'll continue to look at everybody's uh, take or everybody's part in the, in the incident and go from there and determine if we need to charge any other students. Uh, during the initial fight or while the fight occurred, there was no supervision in the cafeteria. Again, we're looking at all the uh, protocols and procedures uh, for the cafeteria and for what happened on that particular day with the staff development morning. Uh, and so a majority of the staff were in development, professional development, and so we're trying to find out where the breakdown was on how uh, the students were left unattended for that short period of time. I do know that a security guard was in the cafeteria at the time, uh, or, or prior to the incident occurring, when the security guard was pulled away, we were trying to find a student that appeared to be agitated on campus, and we were trying to find out uh, more about that student. Uh, the, the security guard was asked to look for the student, stepped out of the cafeteria to go check an area where they believe the student to be, and that's when the fight, uh, the fight happened shortly thereafter.